Carol Peterman, owner of TableFair.com. A question recently came up, what's a good substitute for cayenne pepper? Now cayenne pepper is made from a blend of various small pungent peppers that aren't unique to any one origin, and it's known for its kick of heat rather than having a distinct flavor. The Scoville heat rating for cayenne can range anywhere from 30,000 units for Indian cayenne to over 100,000 units for African. To put that into perspective, jalapeno peppers typically have a Scoville rating of 2,500 to 8,000, so cayenne is spicy stuff. Classic red chili flakes are probably the simplest substitution because they're so readily available. Not quite as hot as cayenne, and because they're flakes rather than a ground powder, you can either grind them down or just use a little bit more to compensate. If you're looking for a substitute chili to use in the place of cayenne, let heat level be your guide. To eliminate heat altogether, select a sweet paprika. Guajillo chilies are one of the most commonly uh, used chilies in Mexico. Think enchilada sauce. They have a 1,000 to 2,500 Scoville unit rating. Some hotter options are the chili diarbo, and uh, they can range between 15,000 and 30,000 on the Scoville scale. Hotter still are the Pekin and bird's eye or Thai chilies. And they start around 50,000 Scoville units and can be as hot as 100,000. Cayenne is a key ingredient in Tabasco sauce, so that can make a good substitute as well. Now, it's important not to confuse chili powder, the spice blend used for seasoning a pot of chili, with chili powder that's a simple ground chili. And chili powder used for making a pot of chili has all sorts of other spices in it, cumin, oregano, and garlic, for example, whereas a pure ground chili will likely be labeled just as that's chili's name, so say ancho chili powder, and that's all it will have in it, or red chili flake. So if you're looking for an option other than cayenne pepper, there's all kinds of chilies out there that you can explore.